Thank you. You know, you know, you see what the production Mason had today. I mean, what's it mean to know he's doing this without Malcolm, without Justin Scott Wesley, without Jay Rowan? Uh, it means that he has other targets. He has other guys that he can throw to. He has a Michael Bennett. He has a Jonathan Rowe. Uh, he has a Kenny Towns. Uh, and I think those are names that not that many people know right now, but when they get into the season, people are going to know them. Uh, because those guys, although they haven't had the time to shine yet, they have the ability to have uh, what it takes to make plays in this league. And I think that they're showing that. Uh, Hudson has weapons everywhere. It's just where he decides to throw the ball. Chris, you got that uh, rollout pass from Jacob Park there in the second half. But what have you seen from him, not, not just today, but kind of just this spring, getting a chance to watch him work with him? Um, you know, I've seen a guy who has a great arm. I've seen a guy who's uh, who knows how to approach practice, who knows how to go in and work knows how to you know be lighthearted and how to connect with teammates. He's only been here for a short while, but he's really gotten into a point of leadership where he can get in a huddle and know each of those guys and start learning how he's got to talk to some of them, deal with them, how to lead the offense down the field. And he's doing really well. And you got a chance also to work with Bryce Ramsey a little bit today uh, when he switched sidelines. Uh, how do you feel like today? I think Bryce did well. I think um, everybody did a good job of stepping out of their comfort zone today and actually challenging themselves, pushing themselves. And some For some people, that's uh, running with no, no huddle. Some people, that's using tempos. For some people, that's running certain plays they haven't run a lot. And, uh, I think the coaches did a great job of putting people in those situations and seeing how they would respond to those things and seeing how they would make plays. What did you learn about your team today? I learned that guys are ready to work, and I learned that we're getting better. I think we're ahead of schedule um, in terms of where we are with these defensive coaches, the changes that we've had. The defense looks light years ahead of where we thought they would be. They look so much better. Even in the secondary, they're playing as a unit. They're playing really well. The offense has made a seamless transition with Hudson. Uh, we have complete confidence in him. And, and the guys are just working to get better, working on the little things. It's the little things that make you win games. Describe the rhythm and chemistry out there with Hudson. Uh, you know, it's, it's definitely... I I guess rhythmic, rhythmic would be the word. Uh, you know, he's he's a guy who uh, really conducts his huddle with a certain air about him. He, he's a leader. He's a soft-spoken leader. He's not a kind of guy who's going to get in your face. He will if he has to, uh, but he knows how to come in the huddle and get everyone's attention and let them know what the goal of the drive is.